Hey, it's Kim here and welcome back to Oxen Free, where maybe Clarissa is dead. She may have also just blipped out of all time and space as well. I don't know. Things are strange. Let's just get back to Ren at the comm tower. Maybe he's had better luck than us at anything. Back to the comm tower. Ren's meant to be there. We also told... Nona to go there. And Clarissa is, who knows, I hope that she's alive, is what I'm really hoping. I don't know if this is the kind of game where my choices... Mayday. May. Oh crap, this isn't. Ren, this is just coming out of the speakers on the roof thing, it's not... Ugh, my god, is this what I sound like? Alright, if Ren and Nona How are in the cone tower... How can stand to listen to me? Just... Where did Clarissa hobble off to? Let's talk to Ren and Nona before we try and find her, cause, but I don't know, maybe they know something we don't. Good thinking. I don't know if this is the kind of game where it's going to have impact through my choices. I don't know because I went to Ren first, this happened with Clarissa. What if I'd gone the other way around? What if the choices I'm making as I play? Hey, hey I, I saw you guys coming up from the tower. Hi. The Dick Tower. I think you mean Harden Tower. How's Nona doing? We heard what I imagine was her first radio cast ever earlier. Yeah, no, she's, I don't know. I mean, she's frazzled one moment, then that makes me frazzled, then she sees that I'm frazzled, so she like freezes up. Any luck contacting somebody? Nope, no luck to speak of. And honestly, I thought this week was going to be a big... Well, we're all here now. Well, I mean, except Clarissa, but we're mostly <laughs> all here and we'll come up with something. I hope so. The stupid radio has been what my therapist would call a negative reinforcer. Just won't work right. Just, I'm so glad I took that second brownie. Oh, what? dude. It's kind of. You Wait, know. second brownie? Right. Please tell me this is a joke, okay? This is a joke, right? Mm, why would this be a joke? I'm not joking. Why would you Wait, do you more drugs? With us? You seriously took another one? Like, it was like it was like half of one. All right. It's just to level me out. It'll. It'll bring me back up. That's what it does. I cannot believe you. You're gonna keel over in like a purple haze while we try and save our lives. I'm gonna be fine. Last time I just ate too much. This was a gimme. It's baby food. This thing doesn't work. Not getting anything? I'm getting something, but it's like, I don't know. Hey, Nona. Night's still going, huh? We heard you on the uh, speaker system. You got that working? That's about all I got working. It's something, well done. Uh, Sorry, I was like weird earlier. But hey, have you figured out what's going on yet? You Mind have the to do something. You've been like spin ghosts. Nona, ghosts are going on. <laughs> Blackouts, hallucinations. It's all been ghosts. Ghosts? Really? Yeah, and it would really yeah. help if you could just jump to the believing us part. It would save a headache. Oh, oh, I got it. This is great. This is perfect. I know exactly what to do. Do you? Do you? Yeah, totally. It's Maggie Adler. Maggie what? No, Adler. it yeah. said it was she Bobby. Had, had a boat. I mean, the boat's still here, but she's not. Her she's... house, manor, or whatever it is, is behind a huge gate. You can see it coming up here from Main Street. No, I know, but the keys to it are here, somewhat readily available. My what? sister, Allie, worked at the park's office in town. She had to deliver that old woman her mail every day. I know that they have the key. Okay, so... No, no, gonna... no, we are not. We are not going to go with the plan. The first plan put forth by the group's resident, Burnout. <laughs> hey, come on. I'm not a burnout. Well, I mean, Jonas kind of does have a point here. Sorry. Like, do you know there's a boat? Or is this like when you knew the teachers kept liquor in the lounge? <laughs> come on. I was like 13 when I thought they all got drunk at lunch. This is a real thing. There's a boat at her dock. Ren, understand it is completely your fault that we're in this to begin with. What? And now you want us to trust you when things are really bad? Come on, Jonas, this is nobody's fault. Ghosts are never anybody's fault, certainly not ours. Yeah, guys, this isn't really a productive. She's it should right. be obvious to even the cheap seats that you're the only new weirdo who throws this whole social harmony thing we got going on out of whack. Come I on, mean, guys. We all grew up with each guys, other. Guys, you know there's no television cameras here, right? Take the energy down a notch. Alex, <laughs> I am not putting my life in his hands. 
This whole thing has been a complete joke to this guy. I, I can't believe you're even kind of defending him. Jonas. I know you said Ren is like harmless or whatever, but I'm over giving him passes. And you should be too. I don't need a pass from you. Alex is okay, my best. You're arguing 15 things at once now. Do the plan, <laughs> trust Jonas, leave Ren, like pick a target, or better yet, just don't. Yeah. Look, I don't care what caveman Jonas says. <laughs> there what is, is a that? boat at Maggie Adler's house. And the key to her house is back on Main Street. And the backup plan for when this thing fails spectacularly is two of us have to stay here by the semi-functioning walkie-talkie. Fine by me. Alex has the radio. Are you okay to go into town? Not that you... Not, not that you wouldn't be okay. Yeah, it's not like... You know... I'm fine. Whatever, I'm ready. She shouldn't... You shouldn't go alone. We don't need, like, three of us up here. Yeah, I'll totally go. It's my... Like, brilliant idea or whatever. Are you kidding? Your food is gonna start kicking in any second. Beyond that, you're a completely unreliable basket case. I am not a basket case. Just shut up, both of you. I'm gonna go Sorry. with Nona. <laughs> okay, keeping in mind who you've been able to depend on the whole night. Yes, keeping in mind who you're tired of. Keeping in mind who's taller. Who do you want coming with you? Nona? Wanna come with me? What? <laughs> I mean, I guess. Why this are you isn't, me shack up with it's this we'll be back later, so play nice in the meantime. They'll be, we'll be, you'll be fine. This is a total punt, Alex. Yeah, this no, is fine, this will be a good, if you don't want to take sides, don't take sides, but no, nobody's happy with this. Oh, just, uh. Yeah, well, I don't really care right now what you're happy with. See you soon. Sort your shit out, guys. Okay, all the way down there. Let's go. Oh, he wants to talk. They both want to talk. Do we want to talk to them? We'll talk to them before we leave because I'm nice like that. They don't deserve talking to, though. They're being childish, like the children they are. We're still friends, Ren. If Missy's sixth grade birthday party couldn't split us up, this certainly won't. Good luck with the thing, Alex. Thank you. And you. Look, just go easy on Ren when we get back, okay? He's fragile. He has like a squirrel heart. I'll see you when you get back, Alex. Goodbye. And we're gonna go with the only person who doesn't shout at me for reasons unknown. That was just absolutely hectic. There was so much happening just then. I don't even know what it was over. And I maybe need to tell Nona that Clarissa maybe died, but I don't know because there's a time loop. And also maybe she wasn't here to begin with. And we opened a portal to another dimension and we released all the ghosts. And I was thinking, I was thinking, I do that sometimes. Do we think someone's tried to do this before? Because there was definitely dialogue of some sort that was about how the transmitter was not opening the portal. And now I've done it. So, someone has tried to release submarine ghosts before this moment and was unsuccessful until me. And I don't really understand why or how, but it's quite scary. I also don't understand Ren's plan at this stage. We're going to get on a boat. Are we just going to sail the boat? We're trying to escape the island. We're just getting out of here. That's the plan. But we also need to get Clarissa before we do that plan. And now I've got to look at where we go. You know, I do remember you from Mr. Tuttle's class. You sit in the, uh, back, behind Jake. I just forgot. I'm sorry. <coughs> oh, hey, it's, it's nothing to be sorry about. I don't talk all that much, so I don't know why you remember me. I'm also just, like, never there. It's right. a loophole where, I don't know if you know this, but if you ditch, you get a detention, and if you don't go to that, you get suspended. But suspensions are like paid vacation, you can just do your work over. So... Wait, if you don't really go to, like, class, what are you doing instead all day? Jenny, the TA, she lets me practice ballet in her studio. Oh, so, cute. Yeah. Really? Oh, you gonna be a dancer? Don't tell anyone, but my birthday's in three days, and I'm having a thing, and you're invited. I think Clarissa's out of town, so... Well, happy early birthday! <laughs> in my family, we celebrate birthdays all week, so you're four days late. You gotta get in the mind state. 
Thanks. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't even know why I brought it up. Because you're scared That's and this is true. weird? I was thinking about... Uh, well, I'm worried about Clarissa and... Well, I was thinking about my last birthday when... No. Actually, sorry. Never mind. This has nothing to do with anything. I'm just in a fog right now. No, come on. I want to hear this. It was last year, your birthday. Go. Just... This was when Nicole was in a car accident. And oh my gosh. So of course we cancel and go visit her. And I'm not going to pout about that. It's common decency. It's fine. But afterwards, after this totally emotionally draining night, Clarissa still came over and surprised me with this huge cake. Aww. And we stayed up and watched all my favorite movies. That's sweet, actually. Clarissa's nice somewhere. My birthday underneath it all. And I just hope she's okay. That's all. We'll find her. I promise. Ugh. Yeah, I know. Let's listen to these rocks now. Somewhere in here. Cake three. The island is famously named after Colonel Caleb Edwards for his glorious and triumphant slaughtering of countless families during one of the great ethnic cleansings of the 20th century. Yay! The forceful removal of an ignorant people to make space for destined holders is a time-honored tradition in our still young country. And you will be a part of that heritage, Alex. Do not resist. It will be over soon. Excuse Why? That... Mm, scary. Don't ever do that again. Do we want to look at this creepy door? It was creepy. Loved it. Happy to leave it. I also want to check out the zigzaggy side of the road because they've got a bridge. It's zigzaggy. And what if they have rocks to look at? Ooh. What is he looking at? Is it going to be like the green light, like Gatsby or something? That's very pretty and serene and would make a really cute wallpaper. I guess the next question is, is if we even somehow manage to get to the boat, which we've got to find Clarissa first before we do that, is do we know how to drive a boat? Because they're not all the same. That's a giant gate. Is that going to be her house? It is. Okay. So that's why we're going after we get some keys, but we've got to go get the keys, go to the tower, and then come back. This is pretty. Something scary is going to happen while we're crossing the bridge. No, I'm just nervous and try to predict when the freaky games are going to freak me out. Discovery Cliffs. What is that weird humming noise? Disconcerting. Makes me feel like we're getting followed or something. How's my map? I can keep going across to Main Street. So it's the Parks and Facilities building. That's down a bit, right? If I'm remembering the right building, I don't think it's far. Yeah, we're we're close. Thank goodness for that. I feel like we looked at it on the way in and commented on it at the time. Is that it down the front? Edwards Island, Guest Information Center. Clarissa, Hello? Where are you? <gasps> how did you get up there? What are you doing? Clarissa, how how are you? How are you not dead right now? Like, swan dive out of a window, empty pool dive, dead. Clarissa! What else did you do? Alex, Christ, what's wrong with her? Clarissa, can you? Can you hear me? Clarissa, wake up. Fight them off. Take control of yourself. Okay, um, radio. Hang in there, baby. Alex, uh, please, can you just... I don't know what you can do, but can you just do something, please? I can, I can radio her. Here we go. Oh, it's like when they want to talk or something. Oh, God. Clarissa, can you... Can you hear me? 
just gonna get the right vibrations happening. I'm doing my best. Oh no, oh no, no, what is that? You think you can control me? No. I'm I'm trying to help you. This is this Help me. Help me. How will that help me? I was looking forward to seeing you. Yes, I used to dream about something like this. Don't you uh, there's a ghost in you right now. They're they've like perverted this ghost. Sounds pretty scary, kids. Better leave the night light on. When you're off, the little machine has no more heart than a brain. No more heart. <gasps> Okay, or she's... I think so. Oh, Clarissa, are you okay? Is you scared she... the crap out of us. I'm fine. I can... I'm fine. I didn't okay. finish the... Are you sure? Because that didn't look great. Clarissa, was that... Was any part of you in there just now? In where? What are you talking about? In you. you. Were like, I mean, were you like sleepwalking or... Can you remember? Or... How did I get here? You don't remember how you got here? There's been like time disturbances or something, and I think that's what's been teleporting people around. So, and we just had one. Time disturbances? So you're just blank? No, I remember something. I remember you with that radio. And Me? I remember feeling like you were the reason all of this was happening. Me or Noya? No. Wait, it's Clarissa's turn already? Yeah, it's my turn. What do you mean, it's Clarissa's turn already? I haven't even asked one question. Everyone's asking me. I get to do the asking now. Are you... are you controlling this? It's, uh, my turn, if that's what you mean. What and is you, going all on? people should know what my question is gonna be, because I'm not gonna waste it. Alex, what did you do? Explain why me and my best friend, and your idiot best friend, and your... Look, when we went into the cave, we found a thing, and I used the radio to somehow tune it in, and I think it jump-started everything. I yes. see. But I mean, come on, like, who knew this would happen? We thought it was a weird trick of light or something. Jonas, now you're seeing who you're stuck to until graduation. Thanks. Clarissa, seriously, I can vouch for this. This isn't her fault. It has to be oh, thanks. Fault. Of course it's her fault. There's no other way. Why? Why does it have to be my fault? Why does it have to be your fault? Are you kidding me? No, him? come on, Clarissa. Let's not do this right You're now. You're gonna learn, Jonas. I swear to God. The town looks at her like she has a red letter tattooed on her freaking Clarissa. forehead. And the giant lit up Christmas tree reason why is that Michael is dead because of her. <gasps> because of her. Clarissa, just shut up. Look around. We're not at high school where anyone gives a crap about your pet miseries. Michael was gonna leave town. He was free. He was out of here until this one convinced him to take her swimming for one last... God knows what. And he what? drowned. He what? drowned Horn Lake while this one could be- you are completely insane! It's like all those after-school specials that warn you about inhuman monsters were all secretly talking about you! Yes, the person who didn't kill her own brother is the monster in this picture, of course. Okay, I'm sorry, but enough, Clarissa. That's enough. It's too much right now. I can't- I can't- believe. Nona, it was awful, all right? It, it's still awful, and, and I- I don't just Alex this is none of my business okay none but we came here to do a thing and that thing is going to get us home so let's get home no uh, no Carissa, what are you oh no hey whoa man do you ever do you ever get deja vu jeez i just got a serious thing of goosebumps from one oh constantly i'm like the empress of deja vu it's kind of been my <sighs> It's kind of been like the theme of the whole night, really. She's not up there now. <laughs> oh, I didn't know. Okay, well, the office that we got to try to get into is like right there. So let's try and whatever our way in. She doesn't remember. She doesn't remember Clarissa was there and then just like told me I drowned my We're brother. Yep, this isn't budging. Um, I don't know about that. I think, yeah, I think we can just bust our way through, honestly. The lock looks pretty worn. I don't get enough breaking down doors in my life, really, so I'm not gonna complain. <laughs> Let's do it. Three, two, one. <sighs> Good job. Cross your fingers and hold your thumbs. Hold your thumbs? I've never heard that part of it. 
To sign up for the aquatics program, please register at the front desk. Oh. Yes. Nope. Uh, okay. Uh, I think here's something. It's another pocket radio. Oh, it's weird. But it, it's like there's way more stations on the dial. Does it go down to 60? Okay. Here's another one. It says they're wall radios. It does. Assisted lock. Whatever that means. Oh, duh. It says right here that each frequency is like a key to open the doors around here. So like ID tags or something. Oh, great. Let's hike it back to the gate. Ooh, wait. Wait, here's like a... Wait. What is this? I Personal effects of Margaret Dorothy Adler. Why would her stuff be here? Didn't her family or, like, hasn't her family been carting her things back to town? No, we can start back. I just want to... Okay, here. To... Ooh. Steal a boat and leave. Whom it should concern. This island and its history is a lie. Jeez, she didn't have fond memories of this place, did she? What? What could that mean? I have been compelled by both forces outside of my control and my own willful concern for the safety of others to conceal the many truths about Edwards Island. But now I feel any further inaction may carry a far greater risk. Many truths? Shh. Inside you'll find two wall-equipped radios. I have commandeered the old Cardinal Station 140.1 and used it to relay clues to the nearby beacons buried throughout the area. Wow. Find these beacons and the notes within and discover the true chronicle of the island. Oh, scavenger hunt! Oh, scavenger hunt, scavenger hunt! <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. To whosoever finds the material, know that I'm discomfited in keeping it hidden and ashamed for the lies I helped preserve. But also know that I acted in what I felt were the best interests for all at the time. And truly for the interest of time itself. Margaret Adler. <laughs> I've had, oh, I've seriously had like dreams about this. Finding a secret, <laughs> digging it up, it turning out to be a mechanical unicorn. Yeah, <laughs> we've all had the mechanical unicorn dream. But I think I'm ready just to go home, to be totally face up with you. Well, we've got a letter here, oh so God. we'll have a look. The Camaloa was destroyed by friendly fire? We, we've been lied to all this time. Gosh, this is going to take a while to read. I'm going to do the old thing I used to do in Eyes of Ara. Hit pause on your video now to read because I'm just going to cut through to save us time. So I wonder if that was the first letter. I think it said we've got letters to find. So the submarine was sunk by friendly fire, which is definitely going to make a whole bunch of unhappy ghosts. And I remember there's a cabin in the woods somewhere up the top that had... A number that said Alex actually said it couldn't go that far the frequency so I want to go and look at that too <laughs> Alex why are you wearing that jacket it's like 75 degrees and the sun's out you know because now and I thought you said you were gonna go swimming anyway oh uh, I brought the jacket because I like the jacket and I never said I wanted to go swimming you just inferred it because I asked when the community pool opens <laughs> I inferred it Hey, Michael, we didn't bring drinks. Did we? Wait, Michael? Uh, yeah. What the heck? What? How? Why am I here? What? You don't want to hang out at the beach? There's stuff in town, but it's all boring here. No, why? Why am I here right now with you? Because you said, I studied enough for my French test. I want to go to the beach. Which I thought was very unlike you, by the way. You made the right choice, Alex. You're dead. I'm dead. I'm dead? I think she's talking about the- Oh, the, the car? No, they don't- Listen, Mom and Dad know. They don't care. Well, I mean, they cared a little, but- No, 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 you- You, you drowned in, in Horn Lake back at home. Yeah, and last week I died in the fire, right? You keep having these nightmares because you eat Mom's cookies like right before bed. And anyways, I'm gonna teach you how to swim at the pool in the park, so don't worry about it. No, I don't. It be a flawless day. It really did. Yeah, no, it did. It really did. Carissa, doesn't this? Don't you remember? We're all on the island. Nona's there. I love Nona like a three-legged puppy, but she would shrivel up and die in the sun. Oh yeah. Yeah, she's better off at home. Trust me. What is going on? How did we jump? 
a year back. Are we going to be able to save Michael? It's been a spell since we did something, right? I feel like I haven't talked to you in a while. How have you been? What's been going on? How's classes? How's... Truthfully, I've, um... I... Ah, sorry. I think... Yeah, I... <laughs> I accidentally left my phone on the ferry because I do things like that. <laughs> oh, God, you idiot. Go get it before it leaves. This when I get soccer back, ball. I'm going to hear an Alex story. <laughs> well, can't I just come with you? I'll take two seconds. Think of something to tell me. But the soccer ball. So... Uh, <laughs> if I were to ask you if you were, um, past Clarissa, that wouldn't make any sense to you, right? Past Clarissa? Like, like am I past the name Clarissa? Or... I guess I don't understand. No, she's I'm, so nice. Like there's a past and a and a future. Okay, a, a future Clarissa. Um, you're right. It doesn't make any sense. Sorry. Um, I'm glad we could all do stuff today. I'm glad you were cool with it. I mean, I know you guys are really close, and like, I know it can be annoying when somebody starts keeping all their time for their girlfriend or whatever. So, I think it would be cool if we could like continue to do things together. Clarissa, no, this, this is different. He's my brother. I've known him since I was born. He's not just a friend I'm losing. Yeah, I get that. I get that. And I'm, um, I'm sorry if you feel like you're losing him because you're not. Michael, uh, he loves you like a lot. I'm sure you know that, but he talks about you all the time. <laughs> oh, Alex did this and thanks for telling me. Yeah, of course. Had to fight the skipper for it, but he didn't reckon how many squats I could do. What did it do? Six? Only on burrito days. Actually, <laughs> Clarissa and I had a nice chat while you were away. Kinda sorry to see you back so soon, to be honest. Oh, really? I'm sure Alex sold you on how I lock her in the basement and treat her like a shaved monkey. The version <laughs> I heard was you trap her in the greenhouse. We talked ex-girlfriends mostly. Well, now I know that's not possible because I don't call them... Actually, I'm just going to stop with that joke, because if I keep going, I'd be due for a little punishment. Yeah, I'm sure. So, sure. I actually really want a cold something, so I'm going to run into town and get, like, a soda. Anybody want anything? Okay. Um... Uh, yeah. Get me a drink, too? Sure. I'll be back. Wow, this is so different. Okay, I'm here. What's the story? I want the news. I want the Alex first edition. What's you going on? You died. Things are... Bad, actually. Mom and Dad aren't great, and I'm like a hair trigger away from spinning off this planet. And hey, hey, look. First of all, Mom and Dad are Mom and Dad. They fight a lot, but they're whatever. Everything always blows over. It's gonna be fine. It's not gonna be fine. It's not gonna be fine. I, I know how this goes. I have insider information, let's just call it, okay? Look, just because Janie's parents got a divorce and made poker nights super uncomfortable doesn't mean ours have to too, all right? And look, I know this was supposed to be our day, but I completely forgot I promised Clarissa I'd do something with her, so thanks for chaperoning. It's I know fine. it's not what you had in mind, so... Yeah, no problem. Just don't get all smoochy smooch while I'm in the general vicinity. <laughs> because that would ever happen. It's important <laughs> to me that you like Clarissa, Alex, so tell me the truth. What do you really think of her? Oh, I want to say stick with stay it, because... Stay with her. If she makes you happy, if she makes you laugh, who am I to say anything otherwise? Thank you. Good blessings, good tidings. She's nice here. You know, I never noticed. That's a good looking jacket. I should ask for it back. I don't like my new one. Feels like I got shoes on my arms or something. <sighs> you know what, Bucko? I need it more than you. No, don't make us go. <laughs> Bucko, you haven't called me that in years. Don't make us go back. And now we see why Clarissa is the way she is. She was nice and Alex was blinded to that because she's the jealous little sister or whatever. Alex, are you 3:20 okay, a.m. Are you back with me now? Man, you've been acting like a I don't even know how to put it, like a bird just flitting around in circles for 10 minutes. What? I was about to like slap you or scream or something. No, no, I I just saw I think I just saw my brother Mike. What? How? I don't Mike, know. He, is he I was it was like those time jumps we're sometimes having, right? This was... It's like we've been having ripples, and this was a wave. I was bumped all the way back to when Michael was still alive. 
right now? Yeah, right now. That's so weird. What the hell? I wonder if we're going to be able to time loop and stop him dying and then technically... Hey, Gosh, what are you... Tower? This one got a little antsy. Weird right. stuff was playing on the radio. That voice said I had a mother's laugh. What is yeah. that? Anyways, are we happy? We are happy. We got a new radio that's supposed to open doors and gates in some magical way. Oh, thank God. I was getting nervous that you would have walked all that way and then not found anything. Seeing <laughs> as how it was, my advice to uh, do the whole thing. Yeah, Clarissa's gone though. Again. Gone, gone like dead? Or Maybe. No, I guess there was a. What'd you guys call it? Like a time loop thing? She pretty much got transmogrified to someplace else. Yeah, should we maybe look for her, possibly? Even if the boat plan works, we shouldn't leave her here. Listen, if we have the key, which is apparently this radio, then let's just go to the house and see. And if it looks like we can leave that way, then we'll go on a Clarissa hunt. <sighs> All right. I Are we sure? To use the radio to tune into the gate, right, Alex? I guess, but shouldn't we go look for Clarissa? So are you gonna try the gate thing, or...? Okay. We're doing the gate. If we're still gonna go to the house, let's just do it. Try the radio, Alex. Wait, do, can I read I the gate number? We'll open this somehow? Hopefully. Give it a whirl. I was hoping for a number. Okay, here we go. That, woo! There we go. Cool. Oh, wow. Neat. <laughs> They're all appropriately <sighs> impressed. Please have a boat. Please have a. It was really interesting seeing the different dynamic of the relationship between Clarissa and Alex back one year, and seeing Michael as well. And I'm kind of a bit mind blown. I definitely do want to try and open more doors with that radio. I definitely remember there was one in that Towie Woods that I want to go check out, but the game seems to be pushing me to go through and look at this estate. So we'll do that and we'll keep our fingers crossed that we get to go back and look at the rest of the map and find some other things later. Thank you so much for hanging out with me for this one. If you'd like to hang out some more, hit subscribe and I'll see you next week. Bye.